and welcome back to Wellness Kitchen. Today I'm so excited to share with you all my unique formula to prevent hair loss and dandruff and promote hair growth. Uh, so basically I'm going to prepare hair oil blend and I'm going to show you how easy it is to prepare your very own hair oil blend at home. So let's get started. Let's take a look at the ingredients that promote hair health. For the base, I use coconut oil. We already know the countless benefits of coconut oil for hair. It might sound surprising, but onion juice is a home remedy for hair loss. Now, if you think that adding onion is kind of a gross for the hair oil, because you're going to apply in your hair and you may just roam around, go out or whatever. But what I normally do, I apply hair oil a night before um, I want to shampoo my hair next day. You can use like lavender oil or any fragrance, you know, good oil. You can infuse in the coconut oil um, so that it can, um, you know, like fade a little bit of uh, aroma of the other ingredients that is added in the coconut oil. Ginger helps stimulate hair follicles which in turn promotes hair growth. The many vitamins, minerals and fatty acids in ginger also contribute to strengthening your hair strands to combat hair loss and ginger contributes to restoring moisture loss as well. Neem leaves known for its medical properties is an effective herb to treat hair loss due to its antibacterial antifungal and anti-inflammatory properties neem is an excellent way to curb dandruff it helps the hair follicles to become stronger and also encourages hair growth curry leaves are a rich source of beta carotene and proteins which can reduce hair loss and increase hair growth they also contain amino acids and antioxidants which strengthen the hair follicles and moisture the scalp. Curry leaves also help remove the dead hair follicles which can be the reason behind the dandruff. Lemongrass oil is an effective dandruff treatment. So let's infuse all these healthy ingredients into the coconut oil. Heat up the pan on a medium to high and add coconut oil into the pan. Add roughly chopped onion and ginger. Add lemongrass, also known as chai patti in India. Next, add curry leaves, known as curry patta. And finally, the neem leaves. Simmer all these ingredients together for about half an hour or till the ingredients that we have added in the coconut oil like ginger, onion, all the leaves looks dry. I mean they will get crunchy as all the ingredients continue to cook. Stir occasionally. I also focus on exercise uh, for my, you know, healthy hair. Like I always love to uh, practice the headstand, elbow stand, uh, in which your head is down and your legs are up. So the circulation happens really well in your brain, you know, in your head, so that it promotes the hair growth. If you can't do elbow stand or handstand, you can just, you know, like um, lay down on your bed and then have your um, head resting like this, all your hair falling down. That also helps a little bit um, to increase the blood circulation in your head. Uh, you can also check out online these days so many resources. I mean, I would not follow blindly any resources, but um, it's pretty common sense that blood circulation is needed um, for your whole body actually 
we walk on this earth the planet whole day on our feet and um, you know all the circulation is happening in this direction so it's a great idea to you know reverse that circulation and bring some to your brain um, that's what I think when onion ginger and all the leaves looks brown and crunchy just like fried turn off the stove and strain all the leaves including ginger onion and store the coconut oil into the same jar or use airtight container all right so here i have my coconut oil blend ready to prevent dandruff, hair loss, and promote hair growth. As the coconut oil cools, um, it again goes back to its original form, the solid coconut oil, depending on the weather. Right now it's winter time, so uh, it solidifies like this you can see, but still pliable. So you can warm up slightly again, before applying into your scalp or you can just apply just as it is uh, no matter how much you cook uh, coconut oil it doesn't burn that's that's great about coconut oil so you can just you know infuse as many ingredients as you want and trust me the smell is not bad at all but as i said if you think that uh, you don't like the smell of uh, the coconut oil blend you can definitely add lavender oil or other you know kind of fragrances that you love I have been getting a lot of requests to share how do I take care of my hair you know what's the reason and what's the secret uh, behind healthy looking hair and my hair uh, actually grows really fast as well and uh, uh, those who have been following me for years might have seen me with a different length of hair with different hairstyles so I'm so lucky enough to you know have a very healthy hair um, a lot of time even you know I got the comment um, saying that I'm wearing extension but I do not need to wear any extension I have my own hair they grow really fast even if I like um, cut let's say if I cut uh, the hair in uh, about like January February by the end of the year they are again like if I cut to my shoulder they are again you know get long till here so that's how fast my hair grows now I have already shared a few videos uh, what can be done to keep your hair healthy uh, you know shiny depending on what uh, kind of uh, hair oil you want to make um, you can come up with your own ideas as to what ingredients can be added and I've been using you know simply coconut oil for years now and lately I have been trying to like you know add some herbs in it um, infuse some uh, you know like a healthy uh, ingredients to make it more effective for my hair there are many reasons for uh, hair loss depending on your stress level your lifestyle so it's not always guaranteed to help you so I suggest to analyze your situation your circumstances and come up with the solution all right so it's night time and um, I'm going to apply coconut oil in my hair and if desired you can also warm it up slightly and then apply on your scalp once you are done applying coconut oil I use brush to um, comb my hair so that coconut oil will be distributed evenly and massage in a circular motion and this helps a lot you will um, feel that your hair gets soft when you wash your hair next morning like so you can just keep massaging depending on how much time you got so I usually massage for about 10 minutes 
I hope you enjoyed watching this video. Please do like and comment below and don't forget to subscribe to my channel for new recipe videos every week. You can visit my website baunaskitchen.com for new recipe tips, tricks and ideas in the kitchen. You can follow me on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram, Pinterest, Baunas Kitchen is everywhere. You can download Baunas Kitchen app totally free on your iOS, Android and many other mobile devices. You can watch me on a big TV screen using Roku, Amazon Fire or YouTube app itself if you have a smart TV. 